Hello everybody, BSW here, and I got some really breaking and bad news. Big Fan Vader, Leon Allen White, passed away back on Monday. He had pneumonia, and I have just learned on Twitter a few hours ago that he passed away, and it really sucks because he was best known for his time with New Japan Pro Wrestling, TNA, and WWE. But it was really fun seeing him in action. Of course, him facing off against opponent, opponents like Sting and even Heath Slater on a past episode of Raw. And he even faced Bram on TNA. But of course, it was a disqualification victory. But seriously, though, Vader needed to be inducted into the Hall of Fame. He should be the next inductee into the future Hall of Fame because he deserves it. And how, and I know it's the WWE's decision, but again, how can they say no to somebody like Big Van Vader? How can they do that? And it was on the 12th of March that he went for heart surgery, followed the heart surgery in May to treat an era. I don't know how to say the word. But again, on Monday at 7.25 p.m., after a month-long hospitalization for pneumonia, which Angry Grandpa had, White passed away. And he even had a match with Shawn Michaels, former Intercontinental Champion, who had one of the best matches in WrestleMania history with, if I remember correctly, Diesel in the latter match. But that's why I love professional wrestling, and I really miss, and I'm going to miss Vader, because it really sucks to lose a legend like Big Van Vader, who refused to go out. He was even named Wrestler of the Year back in 1993 for Wrestling Observer Newsletter and became the XWA Heavyweight Champion once. And even faced Kane at Over the Edge on May 31st, 1998. But again, I'm really sorry to hear about Big Van Vader's passing. And I truly am going to miss him. And I even remember and heard that he passed out at a live event while wrestling. And they were telling him that he would only have two years, if I remember correctly, to live. But he said that he was not going to go down. He was not going to go out. But yeah, he is a one tough dude who refused to go out into the night. But again, it is really hard. And sad to lose a legend. We lost legends like Eddie Guerrero, Dusty Rhodes, Roddy Roddy Piper, Rowdy Roddy Piper, Hot Rod, Yokozuna, who was best known for his rivalry time with Bret the Hitman Hart. You just lost so many. But now we lost Vader. Oh, man. WWE, you need to induct Vader into the WWE Hall of Fame one day. You did it with Ravishing Rick Rude, and you need to do the same with Vader because Vader deserves to be a Hall of Famer. And if you disagree, then you're not really a true pro wrestling fan. But again, I'm sorry for Vader's passing and his family, friends, and fans. I'm sorry for their loss. My heart and condolence goes out to them. Rest in peace, Big Van Vader. You will be missed, never forgotten, and we will always remember you. 
and may your legacy and spirit live on. But one thing is for sure, not only will his legacy and spirit live on, but it will always be time. It'll always be time. It will always be Vader time.